I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is part one about goods and services. Now goods, I'm going to write this up so I don't forget. Goods are something that has been made or grown. And what we're talking about is we are all consumers. We are people who use goods and people who use services. So today, I'm going to underline it. For part one, we're going to talk about goods. And here's the examples. Come over here on the left and put a dot. And we're going to draw a big curved line over and a slightly curved line back connect. Come back to the left. We're just going to draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line and connect. Come back to the left. Straight line down. Slightly curved line over. Straight line up. Connect. We're going to do it again. Straight line down. Slightly curved line over. Straight line up. Connect. I come up and I put one, two, three, four, five little slightly curved lines. Right next to it, put a dot. We're going to draw the letter Y. Now, I come over to the right and I draw a straight line down, straight diagonal, connect. Come on the left, straight line down, straight diagonal, connect. Come back to the top, straight line, little straight line, straight line down, little straight line, straight line, straight line, down, straight line, straight line down. This is a hamburger, these are french fries, and the goods that I am buying or consuming would be called food. Okay? Food is one of the goods that has been made or grown. Now I come down again and I put a dot and from that dot I'm going to draw a straight line, curve line, straight line, leave it floating, come back to the dot, straight line, curve line, straight line, curve line, connect. Now I'm going to repeat or mimic those lines. So I just do curve line, straight line, and connect. Down at the bottom, baby circle. Going across, rectangle, straight line, straight line, straight line. Come down, straight line, straight line, straight line, and straight line, straight line. This is a mobile phone. These are icons. They are electronics. Electronics. And if you think about it, as far as goods go, electronics are a big deal. Okay. Now I come over here towards the right, put a dot, and I'm going to draw a flat oval. Starting on this side of the left, I'm just going to draw a straight line, curve line, straight line, curve line, up, connect. I'm going to draw a little straight line, curve line, connect. Come up to the top, curve line, little curve lines inside, little straight line, straight line, connect straight line, straight line, straight line, connect. And right here I'm going to put a dot, curve line down, up, curve line down, connect. Another goods 
that has been made that we all use. Shoes, clothes, caps, all of these things have been made or grown. We consume them. We use them. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, for my hamburger, the first thing I'm going to do is right next to this wavy line, I'm going to put a red line. And right next to the inside of my container, I'm going to put some red straight lines. This section, or this space, I'm going to do green. This is my lettuce and tomato. And next, I'm just going to take my brown and I'm going to color the meat part, this space, a little bit darker. And then use a light loop-de-loop -loop to color my bun. Now, when I say food as a goods, as a goods, this is food that's been prepared. So this could be a Whopper. If it was chicken, it could be Kentucky Fried. Now, with my apricot, I'm just going to lightly color my fries. But these goods, somebody had to prepare and make. And now, I'm ready to consume them. Okay? Next, really important is your cell phone or your mobile phone. So, I'm going to take a black and color this in. Now, in the old days... People we used to say, well, I don't know if I want my kids to have a cell phone. They're too little. In the baby circle, I'm going to color black also. But nowadays, it's almost a safety caution situation. Because moms and dads can put a marker on here so that they can find you if you get lost. These are all icons for different apps. I wouldn't say go on social media when you're little, but sometimes it does help if there's an emergency. You can call mom and dad or whoever, grandma, whoever your caregiver is immediately with the use of an electronics. Now, a lot of people also use their phones. This is their only, like a little handheld computer. Very important good goods that just really has come into its own during this new millennium that we're in. Okay, last, shoes. Everybody needs to wear shoes. Okay, if you don't have shoes, it's a real bummer. But everybody, hopefully, can get shoes that fit and get them around town. And this is called a swoosh. This is one, one of the makers. I just put it on because I thought it looked cool. And these are your soles. All of these consumer goods, some are made here in the United States, some are imported from around the world. Being a consumer, I definitely would take all three. All right, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here are my goods all colored in. I bet you could think of more that you would consider a good goods that you use as a consumer. Okay, bye-bye.